I put this uh, water on about five minutes ago and there's water in this pan it's already steaming see how hot it is oh yeah it's already warm I mean be too warm to wash your face with right now so you, so you could uh, take a sponge bath pretty fast if that's what you were wanting to do but I was trying to make uh, like some coffee so I, I put it in here because I didn't want this you know iron skillets have uh, oil on them so I'm trying to see what what happens so let's look down here at our flame our flame see going pretty good anyway I got this pan this is just the cookie sheet one of the large ones that I got it it's on bricks the bricks are you you don't really even need them because this is what's holding up the grill is your tuna cans or cat cans uh, but I just like it up off of this sheet metal because this will give it a the sheet metal I don't know I don't think it'd get hot but anyway I just feel like it's better to have it off but you absolutely do not have to have the bricks if you don't have them you can just put this big sheet metal on top of your stove even and do it from there if you don't want it on your cabinet uh, I was just gonna see how long it would take the uh, water here uh, still ice cold this is hot though I mean if if you wanted to uh, not mind, mind a little bit of oil off your pan yeah you could heat up some water pretty quick and take a sponge bath uh, I, I'm gonna time this and see how long it takes this to get hot still cold I'll be back Water's getting warm in here, and another thing that's getting warm, it's raising the temperature in here, especially, you know, having a little bit of steam here, and it's, ew. I don't know, temperature is outside. I ordered a gun so I can start, because I, I want to figure out a heater and stuff to use with this. It's still more like clean fuel it doesn't smell up your place or anything that's why I like it and you can use it for all sorts of things as I'll leave pictures in here of the candles I made and different things I'm still working on it it's a work in progress okay this is really slow but uh, if you're in a small room you could start this up be getting your coffee ready while you're warming up water to do your dishes or your face or warming up your room you could take this to your bedroom put it on a table as long as you you know you put down some kind of metal pan and uh, um, the bricks I'm only using for safety. I didn't want this metal to get hot. But you could use anything. Because it's the cans that are holding up. Uh, this is a gas stove uh, grate. One of the small ones. Not like the new ones nowadays. Like my stove is new. I got this from another house. But anyway. You can brush your teeth. You wash your face whatever if you're waiting on your coffee you can have a hot cup of coffee and then do your breakfast uh, save your hot water you can pour it in a thermos I have me big thermos here you could do you could uh, get your water heated up and uh, and you can have hot water for little bit of dishes or 
or wash up with or whatever and this stay hot all day plus by adding water it's putting steam in the house and it'll also steam warm you up now, you might not want moisture if you was in a van or something you wouldn't you'd want dry heat so and the candles aren't going to put that moisture out it, till you do water you know but uh you can configure this however you need to be this is just giving you an idea how to store that that hot water this is one of the biggest therm and it is a thermos it's not an off brand haven't used it yet and i bought it for you know whenever i need it <laughs> i'll need it one day i'm sure of it so this these burn a long time and those ones you 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 order to cook with you know those well the like Schaefer or whatever they are Schaefer whatever they are uh those flames are really really big and uh they might work on this too but uh this crisco lasts a long time it doesn't burn up like you know this will burn i left one uh, going all night long just a small candle and i woke up and it hardly used any oil and that's the reason why, in the long run, this would be cheaper. And it's not costing me anything for my cans because I have cats. <laughs> and uh, But you need to get that flame as close as you can. The further you are away from the flame to the pot, it's going to take longer. So you could use the tunas. They're shorter. They're not quite as tall as my cat can. Uh, let's see if I can give you a measurement. This is on one of my little freezers. Okay, see the difference? Just a little bit shorter. So the shorter you go, the closer you're going to be to the flame. Now I've got five flames going. i got one in the middle and four did that one go out? Hold on, I got one that went out. Now, I got that back one going. It went out because uh, I used these. So I'm not going to use these for cooking anymore. I can use them in my candles because I'm going to use a smaller glass. And use doubles but i'm really liking these because they're wider i'm really liking the uh the tapered candles you just cut the size and you whittle the top you know so you, so your wick is exposed see how big the wick is the bigger the wick the b bigger the burn so that's what i've got in there now can't see it with a flash I mean but it seems to be doing pretty good now it's been 20 minutes let me see well that water's warm but it's not hot for my coffee I say it's gonna take 30 minutes it don't matter if it takes 30 minutes because uh these candles burn for hours and hours and hours. And uh, all you got to do is keep replacing the candle wax part. The oil will keep, keep on on. Now don't pour your, your spent oil back into your Crisco. You get a jar or something, you do that separate if, you, if you're not going to store them. If you don't have a place to store them. Uh... Because you might, you might want to use that for cooking. And you don't want to contaminate it. So this thermos I'll have here. 
is the biggest one they make. Let's see what it says. It says 24 hour hot. So what, whatever you heat up at whatever temperature, this is going to stay hot for you. And I get the thermos brand. And uh, I remember my dad's old thermos. It, I think it was glass lined. This is not glass line or whatever, but it's still supposed to stay hot for 24 hours. And then you got your big old cup. You could have soup with that, cup of soup. Here's the lid, you know. So you could do enough water here to fill this thing up and you'd have hot water all day. So get up in the morning, get this thing started, get your hot water started, <laughs> and crawl in bed with this thing going, so you can keep an eye on it. It'll raise the temperature wherever you're at, you'll get warm, and then you'll make you an instant cup of coffee, you have all that extra water, and uh you little bit of cleanup you'll have cook your eggs they cook pretty fast on this and took me 35 minutes maybe uh you know you make like an open top grilled cheese like i did and lay that aside and then and then uh cook your meat i did have to pour some water off my meat because it it was cheap meat 73 percent so I did have to pour that water off and put put my burger back in there, but it got it done. So it's all going to depend on your wick size. All in the wick now. Remember that, your wick size. So don't come back and tell me it took you an hour, because that means you used something really tiny. Okay, I'm getting hot in here. This is raising the heat in here. Gosh. So remember those tapered candles. You just cut the size. You only need it about that long. And then uh, you can heat your Crisco. Fill it, you know, up till about a quarter low of the can. And then whittle this down a little bit around it so you can get your wick out. Don't cut through the wick. Just whittle around it. Stick that piece down in there. And uh, this will make about one, two. This will make three more wicks that size. So, I got these from the Dollar Tree, if y'all wondering where I got them. And I ordered, you can order them online at the Dollar Tree. I think they come 18 to a case, something like that. I don't even know. Anyway, they were cheaper than Walmart. Okay, I'm going to touch this again, see if it's hot enough for coffee. No, 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 I really like mine really hot. So, it's 30 minutes see what 35 does finally after 40 minutes I got it hot enough that's hot see it's steaming that took 40 minutes now remember you got to get it as close as you can to the fire and you got to use a big enough wick in each of these cans and it's hot in here y'all so that's your heater <laughs> first thing you can do is Put this together or have it ready for at night with your water and all. Get up in the morning, light all your candles, crawl back under the covers. And this will radiate your heat. And you can have your cup of coffee and save all your hot water in a thermos. Okay, I can blow this out now. I like this taster's choice and I use this instead of sugar uh, because 
I don't know if it's any better. Agra. I don't know. Anyway, I really like it. Oh, yeah, I got to go get my homemade evaporated milk. Here's my evaporated milk I made back in uh, 8 7 20, over two years ago. Let me open it. See that cream on top? That is good. Okay. Let's get my water. Since I did it in Pyrex, it's not burning me. I'm going to blow my candles out because I don't need it for heat. If I need for heat, I'd leave it on. I have all kinds of ways to heat myself, but uh, this is just trying to help the public. Put my cream in there. Someone gave me like five gallons of 2% uh, milk. And so that's why I ended up making this. And this tool right here is very hard to get now. I wish I'd bought two of them when I got it. I can't even find them online anymore. It's to open up your canned goods and it doesn't destroy the lid. The reason why I don't want my lid destroyed is because I can use them for dry canning, like beans and stuff. I can reuse the lid after it goes through the dishwasher. So there's my cup of coffee. Should taste the same. Heated with candles. Sure does. It's a little cooler than, you know, but I took 40 minutes. Now remember, bigger the wick, lower to the to the pan. That's the secret. And then, remember, store your water, hot water. That was a lot of effort. You don't want to waste it. Put it in your thermos. Use it. And uh, time to blow these these out. <laughs> 